how does Chinese Muslim villa look like? This is a common Muslim house. Wow, it's really huge. Let's go inside. Are right, we gonna have the breakfast here? Uh, this is our supplier. They do in the rice noodles. Wow. Look at the door. <laughs> Yeah, uh, this is the villa he's living. Uh, he just got married recently. This is his parents' place, <laughs> just next door. Let's go inside. Here, all the villa, like your family members, yeah? yeah. Oh, one family, just one family, all here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is his uncle. <laughs> it's not like a villa cluster. It's all his family members, you know? They're all Muslim. This is the villa, we're gonna have the breakfast. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven floors. <laughs> Take the elevator. It's like the palace. They've got a really expensive taste. See? And yeah, this is their living room. Wow. Here. Uh, yeah, that is the balcony. Uh, this is the balcony. From here, you can see that the very ancient masjid here. It's also from Ming Dynasty. See that? It's a really traditional Chinese masjid here. Let me show you the authentic Yunnan local Muslim breakfast. Yeah, we start the morning with the tea. Yunnan is famous for the tea. Yeah, we change to another villa. It's his villa, and we're gonna have the breakfast inside. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah, this is the big boss of the rice noodle factory. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, yeah. This is the breakfast. It's a traditional Yunnan Hui breakfast. It's called Rushan. It's made with the milk, like the cheese. Mm. Fried cheese. This is made with the peanuts. It's like the mashed peanuts. I never had this kind of thing. Butter. It's a bit sweet. Yeah, this is a very famous Muslim town in China. It's called Najayin in Yunnan province. 90% of population are Muslim. Here, all the restaurants are halal. Even in the supermarkets, you cannot find any alcohol. Uh, here, the people, they are very wealthy. Why? Because here, it was a center of the steel industry in Yunnan province. So all the all these, you know, Muslim business owners, they, they were in the uh, steel industry. But now, they all switched to the food industry. They are doing the halal food so I have a lot of supplies here so if you want to visit Yunnan you can come here uh, for a visit they have a really beautiful masjid and it's really unique culture and the food here is phenomenal see you next time